All right, guys. So today we're out here on a, actually a mine pit. We're targeting lake trout. It's our first adventure of the year. We got Jared and I and my buddy Josh right behind the camera. You might see him more on here, especially with these lake trout videos. But he's been out the last couple of days fishing lakers. Not on this lake. We got a couple hours today. Sun's going down. We'll try to get that evening bite. Who knows? Yeah, uh, I've never been lake trout fishing in the winter. Super jacked. Uh, we were debating on coming out today. It is absolutely freezing outside, but uh, we had a couple hours here right before dark, and we figured we we're gonna give it a shot. So keep, keep her tuned. I just pulling like a straight idiot right now. How in the world do I let it line? You gotta flip it. I didn't flip it. No, no, why not? Oh, dude, that makes me feel stupid. <laughs> But okay. Yeah, guys, I got a depth counter. Oh, gosh, that's cool. Yeah, you're jealous. Oh, boy. I can, like, barely feel the weight on this. <laughs> like, look at it. I think it's a 2x4. <laughs> I think it's a literal definition of a 2x4. See, I don't know enough about lake trout fishing. Well, so... To where, if, with these battles, these fish and stuff... Yeah, so the big thing is that when you see one coming at you, you want to take it away from them. Like, you don't want to just sit there and twitch it in front of them. You want to just rip it way away from them. Uh -huh. And if they chase after it, then you know they're aggressive. It's pretty much like figure eight. So once you get once you get the fish chasing you, then they'll come up to it. If they don't hit it there, then drop it way down. Okay. And then they'll get aggressive. And it seemed to be, even though small fish yesterday were hitting it on the fall. Okay. You're not even gonna feel a bite. <laughs> yeah, you will. A lake trout? I'm gonna take the rod on my hand. <laughs> Jared, Jared's using six ounce ribeye. <laughs> All I know is that if a fish breaks this thing, we got a freaking. We got a behemoth. We got a beluga whale on the other end, dude. I'm going yellow. Nobody says yellow on. I'm going yellow. No, that's called chartreuse. Going chartreuse? <laughs> Check that thing out. Look at that. It's got a blade on the end of it and everything. That thing's sick. I don't know if the camera really took got into grasp what I'm using here. I got a straight up two by four meat stick. Might as well be using a broom handle. <laughs> My drag is set on musky. My drag isn't set. My goodness. You said yours. That's me going out. You said yours is set on musky. Mine was set on blue oh, whale. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Look at the camera. Sorry. Just you. I think I that was something. Cr it's coming up to me, I think. Yeah, it was on you. Drop down, drop down. Oh. I think that was you. Yeah, that's me. Oh, it's coming up right there again. No, it's on me. Oh my god. On, on. You're up. No! No! Oh my god! Was that? Oh! It's still there. Go back down to it. Yeah. I gotta set my drag a little tighter. Oh my god! Was that nuts? A heart attack. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I gotta check my minnow. No, what is up with you losing fish? Did you see my rod double? Yeah! What is up with you losing fish lately? What do you have on? A tube. Oh my god, it's my giant! <laughs> oh, I think I popped up in my neck. I was <laughs> so worried about that. You got a good outset though. Yeah, I didn't even took the rod out of my hand. Obviously the hook set wasn't good enough. I look up and it was like... <laughs> It hit it good. Oh, it pounded, it pounded it. That was a nice one. Yeah, that was a nice one. Oh, man. No, it was a hook set. That's the only explanation. You got two hooks up. You got four hooks, four barbs, and you got no one. Oh, that's disappointing. That's disappointing. That was the video right there. Yep. We could have made a video out of this. I'm so Let's disappointed. Just Let's just chirp more of this. I really do. The rest of this video. I caught it on this. You didn't catch anything. I hooked it on this. And, where, and where's the fish, Noah? In the lake. 
How was your day three on Devil's Lake, Noah? Having some flashbacks? Big Liz in there. He, he probably went like two for ten. <laughs> I went like four for fifteen, okay. <laughs> oh boy. Our one shot and no one just yeah. blew it. We had one chance. We might as well pack up. Um, God, would that have been nice if you'd have got a good hook set? <laughs> Wouldn't that have been nice if it actually hit one of us so we maybe could have cut Yeah. <laughs> you just lost like a 30 pounder. Yeah, for real. You lost you lost a Mondo. Good job. Honestly, that thing would have been... It was probably, It was probably mid-teens for sure. You just lost a fish of a lifetime, Noah. Let that sink in. All your fault. <laughs> Don't worry, Noah. Now we both lost one. Now we can triumph together. That's true. You wouldn't be fishing if you caught them all. At least you didn't see yours. Oh, I, I mean, felt it though, oh my god. I mean, technically it still would be fishing. The church is loving this, that it happened to me and had him. <laughs> oh, you're loving this, aren't you? I love every minute of this. Because I know well if the roles were reversed, you'd be doing this to me. <laughs> Thursday night is supposed to be negative 20. Josh got one. Josh one. A fish? Where are you on the I don't know. That might be the bottom. No, that's a fish. Oh my that's a fish. god. Are you kidding? Yeah, no, that's a fish. Dude, hold on, take it easy. You're good, you're good, you're good. I'm not caught. Okay, I'm not caught. You're good. Come back this up. Come back this up. I think it's coming. Okay, here it comes. That thing just didn't move as no. soon as it started. Oh. Wait, oh, oh it's a tree. tree. Woohoo! <laughs> no way. Oh, oh, you're dripping everywhere. On the Cleo. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I didn't move right away and then it probably popped loose. Yep, yeah, because it felt like it was, it was sliding. Mm -hmm. uh, well. That got my heart going up. I thought that was a big one. I wonder how long that's been down there. What the chance? What the chance? This is a kitchen tree. I'm happy you got you hooked. I'm happy somebody hooked one. Yeah. Oh Good. yeah. Not that happy. <laughs> See, he lost it. <laughs> Are you really happy, Noah? No. No. It was like it was bigger than that. that. It was more than that. It was, it was literally more than that. Here, here Noah, we'll pretend it was a tree. Then you don't have to feel as bad. It wasn't a tree. <laughs> <laughs> no, it wasn't. All right, guys. So we're back out here on another Laker Lake. I don't know if I included the clip from yesterday, but we were fishing yesterday. I lost a decent one. Um, kind of sucked. I was frustrated pretty bad. I might include clips either before or after this. You might have already seen it. You might see it now. But um, we're on a different lake today. Um, the Lakers aren't as big in this lake. There are a couple decent ones, but we wanted to catch a few. We just wanted to catch some. So, lake trout fishing, it's dark outside. We have to, we can start fishing five minutes ago, but we gotta get going and get out there. So, we'll catch you when we get out there. Josh and Jocelyn are over here in the house next to us. And I think Josh just caught one, so we're gonna go check what's going on. I don't know how I can see in here, but how do I see this? Oh right here. Well we got our first trout of the day. Caught it on a Swedish pimple, size three. It's not a bad it one. a little bigger. Alright, perfect. What do you see? Oh, 
I'll give you a little break on that one. It didn't help that we had about 10 dollars. I got him out. There you got him. I got one. Wait, see if I can. Sorry guys, you probably couldn't see that at all. It's not very big, whatever. Oh, still something. Oh goodness. <laughs> Why I missed on the first time. <laughs> Using his bait. <laughs> There's my first Laker of the year. <laughs> I, don't even wanna, I can't even hold it because it's like 10 inches, maybe. I got one! Yeah, it's like a 10 incher. Just a little spoon. And again, goodbye. Well, so much for fishing in the last couple days. Okay, how does that even happen? I'm caught on both sides of the ice. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, it is roughly 11 o'clock in the morning. Um, this is our second day of trout fishing and we can't get any luck. Uh, Noah caught that little 10-incher that I'm sure you already have seen, and Josh caught his roughly 18-inch fish. But other than that, we've been marking a couple, but we just haven't had anything to bite. I don't know what it is, if it's this really cold weather, this cold front that we have coming through. It's been really, really cold this whole past weekend. Yep. Yeah, like you said, we had that cold front come through, and that just made us not being active, too. We like to bounce around, usually. These past couple days, we had to sit in the house, and I think that could could have been a part to it. I mean, maybe we would have found a few more fish or gotten on a few more fish if we were able to move around a little bit easier, but it is what it is. Uh, we gotta go home, do some homework, and look, look forward to next week, so. Uh, on that note, we're gonna pack up here and uh, we're gonna get off the lake. Yep. So, keep her tuned.